Yo guys, what is up? It is Nick, and today I'm going to be going over the new Football Outsiders. If you're new to Madden Ultimate Team, these are cards that they release usually every Friday. Sometimes they aren't released on Friday for whatever God knows reason. There's usually four players um, that fit in, like, stats that, you know, um, aren't exactly the general stats. You know, not general, like receptions or yards um like sometimes they'll give it out to qbr highest qbr or highest um yards after catch stats like that that usually people don't look at but something that the football outsiders do those are kind of general um there are other ones um like I don't, I don't know you'll see as the time comes but don't be surprised if say calvin johnson has 30 receptions or something crazy like that and he doesn't get a football outsiders sometimes the football outsiders want to make a card like this week they wanted to make andre ellington i believe um but they couldn't because ultimate team uh the developers are actually doing something with him anyway so they are not using him stuff like that um They'll do it sometimes on passes like deflected, different things like that, just trying to give you guys an idea. So let's get into this. There were five cards re released. Um, I like numbered cards more than limited time, uh, but we get limited time this time. I think there's one card that's not up. This is the this is the card that I'm interested in. It's Marquise Goodwin, and boy, does he have some speed. I think that's enough. Yeah, there he is. There's two up for 55k is the cheapest. Obviously, they'll drop because they're impacts for a whole week. Uh, and he's only an 83. Uh, he's got 96 speed, uh, 86 catch, 82 elusiveness, 87 spec catch, and 84 catch in traffic. A poor 77 release and 79 route running, but not too bad. Um, he's going to be the third receiver in Buffalo. Uh, probably a good third receiver on most teams with that 96 speed. Um, I like Marquise Goodwin, so I'm definitely interested in picking up that card, but only for the right price. Definitely only for the right price. So let's get into the next card here. We're going to look at Micah Hyde, uh, the uh, safety for Green Bay. So he's not a wide receiver. I can just call him players, I think. Yeah, all right. Micah Hyde is 30K. There was one up for like 15. I almost bought it, but then I thought to myself, I don't want to get screwed on 15K. Uh, so Micah Hyde, 89 speed, pretty good, uh, 86 zone and 79 play rack, along with 88, 80 man, 90 acceleration, 74 tackle, 85 pursuit, and a very poor 73 hit power. Um, not a card that I'm truly interested in since I have Charles Woodson, so I'm not going to go too deep into Micah Hyde. I'm not going to go too deep into any of these cards um, because I'm I'm not the I don't think any of these cards are cards that you'd be too excited for. Um, this is the card, Taron Armstead, that wasn't up on the block. So let me let me see if he's up now. There is one up, thank goodness. Uh, he is an 84 overall, uh, 91 strike, 92 pass block, pretty good, 85 run block. I like run blocking. Um, since I'm using Vic, I can run a little bit away from pressure, so... Uh, run block is more important to me. I don't really need any linemen, so not too interested in him either. Um, he's got 80 speed. I'm happy they display that on offensive linemen's cards. 80 speed is pretty darn good. 87 acceleration, 74 awareness, 81 agility, uh, and 88 impact blocking. Pretty good card. Uh, not a card that I'm 100% interested in, but may get it to test it out if it drops cheap enough. Next is Demontre Moore for the uh, New York Football Giants. Uh, let's I've been more, and then I got to up the quality to 85 to 89. And the Montre Moore is 43,500. Obviously, all these prices are going to go way down. Um, but for right now, if you want to get them day one, you're going to have to fork out some coins. Uh, speed is 80, 84. Oh, I forgot to tell you what position he was. He's a left end with 80 speed, so pretty good. 84 strength, 84 block shed, 87 tackling, 90 acceleration. That's really good. Uh, 92 power move, uh, 79 for net. Furness, finesse and 68 play rec so pretty good to Montre more and then the final card we're going to look at is the uh limited time it's available for 24 hours starting sometime this morning i don't know um when it actually expires but he is up for a 50k and then there's one up for 168 i'm not gonna buy this 50k uh maybe if this was like 
at the end of the week, maybe I would, but uh, right now I'm not going to fork out 50k on the slim chance he might sell. So he get, he's speedrun chem, uh, 87 speed, 87 catching, 90 catching traffic, 66 route running, ew. Uh, 81 release, 84 strength, and 78 run blocking. That's pretty good run blocking. If I could find him for really cheap, I might actually consider picking him up just for some run blocking. I'd use him behind Dave Casper, but... Uh, not going to, but those are the week one, or that's actually preseason, I guess, football outsiders, so, um, they will get better to come, um, I, I kind of wish football outsiders would have gone with something better, just, uh, start out with a bang, but they then, uh, let me know, um, I got one question, let me know who has the best run blocking for a tight end, um, I'm, I'm kind of interested on that, but, uh, I hope you all enjoyed the video, drop a like if you did, subscribe if you have it, and I'll catch you on my next video, peace out.